Welcome to the first Inner Sanctum unboxing video. In unboxing videos, where basically you'll get to see me open up a new piece of vinyl, a CD, or a tape, and add it to my collection. Um, stuff like this is pretty popular amongst the heavy metal channels and all that stuff, and as I mentioned way back in the very first episode of Inner Sanctum, I was inspired by those heavy metal collection videos, so I figured it only makes sense to finally integrate this into the Inner Sanctum, so here we go! So, I haven't had a lot of money lately. I've been having, well, I had some medical bills late last year, which really set me back a lot, and just because of shit like that, the credit card bills started piling up, and I haven't had a lot of money for uh, buying CDs, tapes, and vinyls. But when I have had extra, I do buy stuff, and uh, I, I can't really ever explain it, but getting new CDs and vinyls in the mail has always meant a lot to me. It's something that goes back to like my late teen years when I first started ordering various uh, like underground heavy metal and just underground labels in general and it's a feeling that I've always really enjoyed when I come back from a hard day's work and I see those packages sitting on my porch it just I don't know it just fills me up with such happiness it always has and I, I'm sure I'm not the only one I'm sure a lot of people feel these same things and uh, I, this has been sitting in my uh, room here for a few hours now so it's been kind of <laughs> something to open up but I wanted to finally do one of these videos to show it and uh yeah so we can check it out together and uh you know you can see what I got and uh you know we can uh, bask in the glow and the, the warmth and the loveliness of just getting a new piece of uh music to add to the collection and I haven't actually heard listen to this one either yet and that's uh I'm pretty excited about that because this is an artist I would otherwise have uh checked out a long time ago because it's an artist I've loved for many years but I wanted to wait till I had money to buy this and I I finally uh, just pushed all the other things aside and just bought this with a little extra money I got from, uh, well I sold this, this demo CD from, from this black metal band I got a lot of, actually got a lot of money for it, so I had a little extra money to play with and so I got a couple of vinyls, so I'm pretty stoked about it, I'm pretty excited. So here's a scenario for you, it's Friday, well it could be any day of the week. You're tired, you're mentally exhausted, and gosh darn it, the weight of the world's on your shoulder, and you just kind of feel like shit, you feel pretty depressed, and you're just... All you really want to do is just get home from work, take a shower, and go to sleep, and possibly not even wake up from that sleep. You're just that down. I get that way a lot, and it's pretty unfortunate, but when I come home from work and I see these packages, one like this, for example, bleeding on my steps, I just start glowing and I get so happy. And as I already said before, um, this has been uh, pretty tempting not to open this up for these past few hours, but. Here we go, finally. This is a recent order I made from Cryo Chamber, and uh, we all know who Cryo Chamber is, and I am going to be doing that Cryo Chamber special I hinted at several months ago. That's going to be the next proper episode. But here in episode 11 and a half, or this unboxing video, if you will, we will have our first glimpse of the Cryo Chamber special. So, this is one single vinyl. It's just something I've wanted for a really long time. I haven't listened to this at all, and it's, uh, it's one of my favorite Dark Ambient projects. It's one of my all-time favorites, and... Uh, well, the project in question is Atrium Carcere.
doing that. I sort of had this, uh, this is kind of random, but I just had this idea in my head. I really wanted to start collecting uh, signatures from Dark Ambient to uh, projects and producers uh, around the world because uh, it's such a great community and everyone's really friendly in the Dark Ambient scene and there, there's no eagles. I mean, not that I've like, picked up on or anything like that. And uh, it's such a great community. I'm glad everyone just really gets along. So thank you so much for doing that, Simon. It really means a lot, man. So, uh, so there's the sleeve, yeah, and as I already said, you know, it's beautiful, just, when you look at this, it kind of, I mean, there's so much going on, there's this, this really mystic looking priest, bishop looking guy here, he's holding some sort of crystal ball or something, and then there's castles in the background, these giant totems or something, I don't know what's going on, but it's just, it's awesome, I love this artwork, it's Beautiful. It looks so good on vinyl. And the back cover too, of course, too, is more of these castles and these cavernous. Just so much depth to this. I love it. It's beautiful. And uh, in a way, it kind of reminds me of some of those old DNC grave, uh, those paintings they did for some of the old death metal albums back in the late 80s and early 90s. Just really cool. I love it. Just so much going on here. So, yeah, and... Like I said before, I haven't listened to this yet, so I am so excited to listen to this in a few minutes as I stop this video, so incredible. And then, let's take, check out the vinyl itself. Yeah, there's the A side. And then the B side. Alright, yeah, there's uh, that bishop, that creepy looking dude on the... A label here in the middle here. In the back too. Yeah, awesome. I can't wait to play this. Alright, well this is been the first uh, Inner Sanctum unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed this. Um if you own this album, I would be really curious to hear your opinion of it. If you have the vinyl in particular, I'd be really curious to hear it. I know the, the C D Digibook is has a much more expanded artwork and I know there was an option to buy both the CD and the, uh, the vinyl, and I was pretty tempted, but I just don't have enough money to do it right now, which is pretty unfortunate, but maybe in the future I can take it up, hopefully it doesn't sell out or anything like that, so. Uh, this is super cool, though, so. Thank you, Cryo Chamber, thank you, Simon, once again, for producing this amazing music, and, uh, of course, for signing it, that's so awesome, man, I really, that's amazing. It's great to have your autograph and everything. Nerd, you get to, I hope you guys enjoy this video. You get to see me nerd out a little bit, and uh, that's it. Um, uh, I'll make more of these. I got another order coming soon from uh, another well-known Dark Ambient producer, and he signed it as well, so I'm pretty excited about that. So when that comes, we'll make another of these videos. So thanks again for checking out, guys. All right.